In 1954, producer Sam Phillips introduces a 19-year-old singer from Tupelo, Mississippi. His name is Elvis Presley. By 1956, his Heartbreak Hotel sells a million records and stays at number one for seven weeks. The power of rock and roll becomes unstoppable. Ed Sullivan hosts the most popular show on television. His musical taste, middle of the road. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Your Mercury dealer. But on September 9th, 1956, he puts rock and roll's biggest new face in front of America. Number one TV variety show, starring the nationally syndicated columnist of the New York Daily News, Ed Sullivan. Elvis Presley simply cannot be denied. This is the first time this footage has ever been seen in color. Thank you, Mr. Lawton. Ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Uh, this is probably the greatest honor that I've ever had in my life. Uh, there's not much I can say except maybe it makes you feel good. This is the most watched show of the decade, bringing in 60 million viewers. The popularity of Elvis and rock and roll explodes. The new teenage music upsets many American parents. But some teenagers are rebelling in a more idealistic way, daring to confront bigotry and violence. <laughs> 